All right, in this video, we are taking a look at the Khan Academy Challenge, the boxer model. And so it showed this picture, this website shows pictures of boxer dogs. And we want to add a border to all of the photos. It says try to make it look like a photo frame if you can. So let's take a look here. Um, there is a div with the class of photo gallery, which is all of the photos. And there's a div with a class of, or there's these images have the class of photo. So I want to put the border on the class photos, not on photo gallery, because I want it to be around each individual photo. So I need to use this one right here. So I'm gonna put my cursor there and press enter. And then I'm going to do border dash style, uh, colon, space, and it automatically adds my semicolon. And I'm going to do inset. Okay. And then I am going to hit enter and I'm going to do border dash. Um, is it width, I think? And I didn't spell border right. Let's do that. And I'm going to do six pixels and a semicolon. And then I'm going to do border dash border dash color sem colon space it automatically adds my semicolon and I'm gonna do red okay so now I have a red border now it says can you use the shorthand property a uh, shorthand border property in this challenge instead so what that would mean is instead of typing border dash style, border dash which border, border dash color, I just type border and then I do, I think you do the width first, so I'm going to do 7px and then you do the style, so if I did dotted, um, which is not what they asked for, but it's showing you that it's changing, and then I do um, green okay so instead of doing um, each one individually if I do the width first the color or the style and then the color it will make it look like this um, it will it will apply the effect instead of having to type all these out you can use the shorthand where you just type it all in one line like that so that's great let's go on to the next step and they want me to, the photos are too close together, add margin either on all sides or just on the sides that matter to separate them. Okay, so they're all lined up here. So really all I need to do is add, I can even just add a little bit of border to even just the top or the bottom. Um, so it says add margin. So let's do margin dash bottom colon space I add my semicolon and let's do 10 px and you can see right there it just bumped and gave us a little bit of extra margin there let's just do 15 okay so I don't um, apparently it wanted me to put margin on all sides or at least a certain side or something so I just put 15 pigs margin 15 puts 15 on all four sides of it and that was uh, what they were looking for there so next step add padding around all sides of the gallery div so it looks better okay so I want to add padding on this one right here so I'm gonna do I'm gonna do enter and then I'm gonna do padding and we let's make it let's just make it 30 px okay all right that was it I added padding and it bumped the entire um, box out a little bit so that is how you complete the boxer model